Good morning, my dear students. How are you? I hope you all are fine and keeping well at home. Dear children, welcome to the MSc class. Today we will study chapter one. Thank you, God. What is the name of the chapter? Thank you, God. Dear children, God is the creator of everything. Who is the creator of everything? God is the creator of everything. How? Because God has made the sun, moon, stars, rain, rivers, mountains, our earth, plants, animals, human beings and God has given us life and air to breathe. God has given us life and He has given us air to breathe. So dear children, we should always thank to God because God has made everything, everything. He has made human beings, He has made he has made you, he has made me, he has made our mommy, papa and our family. He has made mountains, stars and everything. So, we should always thank to God. Children, everything, whatever in the world, only God has created. And he is the creator of everything. For that, we should always thank to God. Okay, children? We should thank God for lovely things He has given us. Dear children, on the page number 10, there one poem is given. That poem you have to read and learn. Sing aloud the following poem. Thank you God for the world so sweet. Thank you God for the food we eat. Thank you God for our daily bread. Thank you God for everything. May God bless me. May God bless all. So dear children, this poem is very nice. By this prayer, by this poem, we thank to God. Dear children, our family is the one of lovely gifts of God. Do you have lovely family? Yes. I also have, you also have that lovely family who has given us. God has given us. For lovely family and lovely brothers, sisters, for that always we should be thankful. And you can thank God by praying to God. You should thank God by praying to God. You should pray to God in the morning and at night. When we have to pray, we have to pray in the morning and at night. In the morning you should thank God for the new day that he has given you. You should ask for his blessings for the day. Dear children, why we should pray in the morning? We should pray in the morning because God has given us a new day. A new day he has given for that we have to pray. We have to ask blessing for the day which he has given. Before sleeping at night, you should thank God for all the good things that he has given, given you during the day. Dear children, at night, why we have to pray at night? Before sleeping, because we have to thank God for all the good things he has given during the day. Whole day he loves, he cares and for that we have to thank God. And while you pray, dear children, 
while you pray you should close your eyes and speak in your own words you your feeling should come from the bottom of your heart try to concentrate on god dear children when we pray how we will pray we have to close our eyes like this and we should pray to god how with on our words and that prayer should be come from bottom of our heart we should concentrate to god when we pray like this we close eyes concentrate on god and we have to pray and we have to thank god okay children so dear children i hope you understood this chapter in this chapter what we had learned we had learned that god has god is the creator of everything god has made the sun moon stars rain rivers mountains our earth plants animals human beings and good and god has given us life and he has given us air to breathe and many more things he has given us like food fruits everything so dear children for everything because only god has given us so we should thank god that's all for today thank you and have